happening, you guys? It's your boy, Jay Crispy, a.k.a. Jay Crispy. You know why, because we stay fried like always, man. Welcome to another episode. This is going to be number two for you guys, man. I'm excited about this. Hopefully, you guys like what you're seeing. Uh, today, we're going to get into some flour and some butter, man. Uh, of course, we got some Revolution products for you guys today. I know we talked a little bit yesterday about that Double Gorilla OG. Uh, I did mention that I smoked it. I've been smoking it for the past day and a half. And I figured we'd get a little more into it today and figured maybe take a couple of hits of that butter, that Alien Rock Candy Butter that we uh, showed you yesterday. So cool, man. Let's go. So that Double Gorilla OG. Good stuff, man. Um, I got some broken up already, so we're just going to pack this ball. And while we're packing the ball, I'll tell you guys a little bit about it. So, like I was saying, man, it's by Revolution. Um, they're in Delavan, Illinois. So, great company, like always. Everything from edibles, concentrates, to flour. Great fucking product, as always. Um, this is going to be, I want to say, yeah, 30.19%. Um, strain properties are going to be mood elevation, stress relief, pain relief, fatigue relief, um, tested, packaged, all that from the lab. So let's try it out. I like this, man. Like I said, I've been smoking it the past day, day and a half. It, it's good stuff. It's, uh... <coughs> <coughs> It's a hybrid sativa dominant. <coughs> so it's a good daytime strain. <coughs> it still gives you that deep euphoric high that you're looking for. <coughs> Without putting you to sleep, still keeps you up. Gives you that sativa edge. <coughs> nice, piney. It's got that gorilla OG funk to it. So, you know, them, them vets, them experienced smokers, man. That's that shit that you're going to like. Uh, my first time ever hearing or seeing a uh, double grill OG, so I grabbed that shit right away, man. And let me tell you something, I am definitely pleased. So, take another hit of this beast. <laughs> All right, let's get into this butter. Like I was telling you guys yesterday, man, it's alien rock candy. Uh, I got a gram of it. <coughs> Uh, it's 88.56% total uh, cannabinoids. Again, LK Pure Labs does all their stuff, I'm pretty sure, at Delavan, Illinois. So, let's take a couple hits of this. Uh, got a nice fat chunk here, man. This stuff right here, uh, very clean. F flavor profile is very nice. You can taste every bit of it. Goes down pretty smooth, too. Usually, uh, you know, in my experience, in the beginning experience of smoking concentrates, my trouble was the uh, butane burning the chest and stuff like that, stuff like that. But when you're getting stuff like this from the lab and it's it's pure THC and and it's taken care of and done professionally, you don't get that. It's smooth going down. It tastes great. You don't get that harsh fucking hit. You can taste and or you can taste the uh, flavor profiles. Take a nice big hit, and not fucking die. So let's take a fucking nice little hit of this puppy. Shout out to Revolution too and Greenhouse and Morris, man, where I get my stuff from. Like I said, great fucking dispensary. People are awesome there. Take care of me all the fucking time. Um, you know, let me heat it up a little more. Take care of me all the time. Uh, the products, like I said, by Revolution are fucking A1, like always. Great shit. Great, great shit. Right. nice man this is my uh <coughs> this is my first time using a nectar collector i usually use a rig <coughs> with a bucket on it and uh if not i use a pen <coughs> but this is my first time using 
one of these and I'm definitely pleased I like it. It conserves, <coughs> you get nice big hits off of it, it does its job. <coughs> uh, <coughs> oh, I almost forgot. Before, uh, before we go, you guys should check this out at your local dispensary, man. I got this syrup. It's uh, <coughs> it's from Revolution 2. Also, <coughs> a great product. Uh, you can mix it in anything. Um, total cannabinoids is going to be 87.23%. It's 100 milligram THC cherry limeade. Like I said, you can mix it in anything. I put about 30 milligrams in my drink. I used fruit punch, just something I had around the house. You can use anything. I think juice, water, tea, soda, whatever you really want to do. Um, like I said, I put 30 milligrams in there. Uh, that was perfect for me. It hit pretty nice. I think I could have maybe went up about 10 more milligrams, if anything. And then um, that probably would have been good enough for me. Like I said, I think I might have smoked a, a bowl after that. And I felt pretty good for about four hours, maybe three or four hours. So definitely check it out. Again, by Revolution, the fucking star of the show. Syrup, cherry limeade, 100 milligram THC. Definitely check it out. I'll put a picture up. In a link in the description um, and you guys could check it out and see if you guys like it for yourselves um, also I'm gonna post another video on June 1st I'm gonna try to do two videos a week but June 1st is gonna be the next video I'm gonna go to the dispensary we're gonna grab some flour most definitely probably some concentrate um, probably some edibles we might try some new things um, that just came out and then do some reviews so if you guys have any strains edibles concentrates anything you guys see or some new stuff you've heard of or would like me to try or do a review on definitely drop a comment down low and let me know i'll get to it it is your boy j crispy aka j crispy you know why because we stay fried until next time man watch out for that video on the first peace out